boy. Bye, Bye Sky. <laughs> Good to have you, man. Thanks again. Yeah, sure. Happy Sunday morning, everybody. Uh, I got a good night's rest. I know a lot of those others were pretty uh, drunk last night. I was not, which is good. And uh, got to sleep in a nice comfy bed. Just got some breakfast with Scott. He's going to go about the rest of his day. I am going to go explore some abandoned train tracks. It's way cooler than it sounds, and it already sounds cool. Let's go. So you may remember last time I came to Philly, this gate was completely closed off, no way to get in. Well, that's not the case this time. So, and just to be clear, this sign says no loitering. Nowhere around here does it say no trespassing. Very easy. Oh my god. I want to shoot a movie here. Look at this. Holy crap, this is awesome. Someone or a couple people definitely live in here. And it looks like they may even have electricity. Which, good for them. If you're gonna be homeless, at least you can have a place of your own. So that you're not homeless anymore. Oh, this is so cool. This is the kind of stuff I wanna do more of. Tables were up here because this is an electric train line, and these things are made out of ceramic and they insulated them. Still not gonna touch it. Don't know if it's still on. There's another building right there. Let's see if there's a way to get in. This is definitely no train station. Looks like they have all the doors bricked off, which is okay. It's for good reason, I'm sure. Inside this place looks like it's falling apart, but it still would be cool to explore inside there. I'm curious what this looks like down here. Well, I found sort of a makeshift ladder to get down from there to up here on the roof. <laughs> it worked. And the view is amazing. It's a little scary getting up here though. Oh yes, I got a view inside of this place. Check that out. All right, time to go back down this sketchy ladder. Not looking forward to this, but this was worth it. Sketchy. <laughs> and deeper and deeper into the wilderness. Look at this. Someone has built a swing from up there. This is so much fun. <laughs> they did a quality job with this swing. Swinging for now. This continues to go on for a very long time, but I'm gonna turn back. Um, maybe when I get back to where I started, head back the opposite way a little bit, explore a little bit of that, and then head to the bus station. Oh, this is so cool.
I have taken a lot of awesome photos. At least I think they're awesome. Um, <laughs> and I'm gonna have way too many to post on Instagram, but I'm gonna post a bunch. So, if you don't follow me on Instagram, um, right here is a link where you can click and go follow my Instagram. I feel pretty confident saying that I guarantee you'll like at least most of my photos. But the ones from this trip are gonna be awesome, so go check it out. Seems a little crooked. Keep going. No time for swinging. Next time. Well, it looks like the direction I went initially was the right direction because I'm going this way and it looks like it just dead ends. Well, I guess it's time to head back. That was so cool. This is so cool. I'm still here. Uh, I can't recommend it that you do this when you come to Philly, but if you happen to do it, it it's worth it. But don't don't trespass. It is really humid today. Sweat like crazy. in Philly for part of Friday, all of Saturday, and part of Sunday. So I was there for two nights, and I want to show you how I packed. So this was the bag that I took. It's just my camera bag. Inside here, normally, I have an extra lens and a camp uh, battery grip that I take with me. I took those things out so that I could fit an extra pair of underwear, an extra t-shirt, an extra pair of socks in there. And that's all I needed. <laughs> I have my camera stuff. Oh, and it, and my chargers for my phone and that kind of stuff. But um, that's all I needed. I basically an extra change of clothes. So I know a lot of people like to pack everything that they may need. I like to pack light. Because all I had to carry around was this bag. I didn't have to drop off luggage anywhere. I didn't have to do anything. It was just that. And it was great. Travel on light. That's it. Hey! We did it! Woo! The U.S. Women's National Team just won the Women's World Cup. Congratulations, ladies. They scored three goals in the first five minutes. Crazy. I'm gonna edit video for the rest of the night, so I'm done for today. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. This is really relaxing. Get off my lens, bug.